sweet dreams. It's Cambridge for Prince Charles. Trinity College, best known of the university's colleges, will for some time to come be the home of Prince Charles. Henry VIII called it his Royal Trinity College, and it still is in several respects. Its flag is the royal standard of Edward III. Its master is appointed by the crown. Lord Butler, master of Trinity, said that Prince Charles will be treated like any other student. With Lord Butler, the responsibility for Charles's education will lie with the tutor of the Prince, Dr. Dennis Marion. It's not certain what Charles will study. It may be constitutional history, as did his grandfather, George VI. What is clear is that the world which will open for the princely undergraduate won't pose severe problems. His early experience at Timbertop should more than stand him in good stead. So there should not be any worry about eating off the bare scrub boards in the vast and drafty dining hall, nor any anxiety about having to dash in dressing gown across the quadrangle to communal bathrooms, whatever the weather. The feelings among the students about rubbing shoulders with their future king is that most of them take it for granted. A healthy attitude which Charles's father is bound to welcome. Cambridge has much to offer Prince Charles, not only a full and rich academic life, but also the intrinsic beauty which for centuries has been enjoyed by all who ever studied there. Plus, of course, the good-natured fun. <laughs>